when an athlete performs, there is just the flow. There is no identity, separation, time, or ideas. The same thing is true during dance, art, creation, or combat. One is in the zone, feeling everything, cherishing the isness. Any ideas of being an entity in time are impossible to be present. If they arise, the flow is immediately lost to self-consciousness. How am I performing? How am I being perceived? Am I good enough? It is a contraction of the whole into an illusion of being a separate part. When there is no entity, there is pure flow. These questions never arise. There is a fearlessness and conviction that cannot be found elsewhere. This is why spiritual realization of empty light yields purity of flow. The entity mirage is no longer able to be formed, ever. This purity of flow is an absolute trip on every sensation, emotion, thought, relationship, transformation, contraction, and expansion. Loving the dance is like being a tree or a bird chirping on the branch. It is like being a sensei hysterically laughing, then sniping delusion. It is a complete and utter surrender into the mysterious infinite flow, allowing everything to be as it is like the sunlight shines. Learning how to die deeper into love. Learning how to balance it with wisdom. It is the visceral and irreversible realization that nothing is happening outside of perception. Perception is obviously the ultimate experiencing creation. There is nothing left but to die into the dance. To completely and utterly die on your sword. Dilate your third eye to the tribal wisdoms of creation. 